Is there any player you, you idolize? Oh, we should. Sarah. Sarah. Yeah, I think she, she's she's done it all. She's five times world champion, she's Commonwealth gold medalist. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I've always looked up to Sarah and I've always loved her style of play and thing. And recently, recently when I was in New York, someone said, you know, your backhand volley reminds me of Sarah. And I'm like, that's like the biggest compliment I've ever got because Sarah's always been very, very strong in the circuit and been very famous for her volley. Mm -hmm. So I think, you know, there are little, little things which I pick up from Sarah and, you know, it's obviously helping my game. And, uh, women women athletes in India so I think you know I wouldn't be wrong to say that squash for, uh, that minute was like squash a few years back until Saina came on the circuit and I would definitely like to do what Saina has done for squash and I think she's done brilliantly for the country you know she's handled the pressure she's handled everything so uh, in a mature way and I think she's a very, she's a good role model for a lot of people taking up sport in the country. I know what I know what I want to achieve, and I, I'm, I'm surrounded by people who keep me very, very grounded. And it's like when I go back home, I'm just like my, you know, my other sisters. My mom uh, shouts at me for not shutting the drawer of my cupboard or things. So I'm just like another, you know, normal girl. But I think just to keep away from everything, I just keep reminding myself that, you know, your world number 15 and your main goal is to get into world number one. So I think until I get there, you know. I'm just going to ignore everything and I think the best way to do it is to ignore everything and just follow, follow what you want to do.